Hi, and welcome back to another Football Share Review. Today, we are looking at the Inter Miami home shirt for 23-24 season. Now, I mentioned when I was doing the away shirt that I had the home one on order, and this is for my youngest. So she will be turning two in October. Um, that's her name there, Lara. Um, and her birthday is on the 8th, which is why we've got number eight on there. Um, she wanted a pink football shirt, so I thought, well, I've had a few requests for the Inter Miami one, so I would do it as part of a shirt for her, because she wanted, say, wanted a pink one. Um, so this is going to be a kid's one. It is probably the smallest one, I think, it's a size 16. So I'll be able to then see what the measurements are up on her to see whether this is the right size or not. So the shirt itself just comes in a standard bag and we do have the usual health warnings on this side. Oh, actually, and there you can see the size 16. Um, this shirt was purchased from fofoshop3.com. All details for the seller will be in the description of this video. If you have any questions, comments or messages, by all means, leave them below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Um, I have had a few people say about the smaller size shirts for them, their youngest. So hopefully this will then show whether it is the right size to go for or not. So what we'll do is we'll get this bag open and let's have a look at the Inter Miami home shirt for the 23-24 season. Well, I think this is the smallest review I've done on this channel. I don't think I've done a size 16 before, um, but it's tiny. It really is so small. Um, yeah, it's actually quite amusing how small it is. So hopefully it will fit her. Um, and that stripes, the collar, <laughs> the collar looks full size compared to the shirt. Um, completely covers the Adidas stripes, um, but they have been embroidered into the material. Likewise on that side, the collar is just looks really big. Um, the Adidas been embroidered into the material and that does look a little bit low down. Um, I don't forgot the shirt hanging on the wonk, I might have actually. The Inter Miami badge has been embroidered on, obviously. Being a kiddies one, they don't do the player version, so that's why these items have been embroidered in. Shirt sponsor has been heat pressed on though, and that actually feels absolutely lovely. That is really smooth. At the bottom, we do have the arrow ready. It's been heat pressed on, and nothing on that side. Just notice there are no sleeve sponsors on this one. So the away one did have the MLS, I think it had Apple TV on that side. And I know Inter Miami do have a sponsor on this side now, but that wasn't included on my away one. Um, but this one doesn't have anything on there. In all honesty, I'm not too bothered, uh, being the kid version. The Adidas, I did touch on it. It doesn't look the clearest, but it looks okay. For me, I'm not overly bothered about how good this shirt is. She wanted a pink one. She's not even two. This she's gonna get it messy. So, well, <laughs> messy. That kind of um, goes well, doesn't it? Um, but yeah, she's gonna get it messed up. So for me, she'll just be happy having a pink shirt. So we'll flip it over and we'll have a look at the reverse side. Okay, we've now flipped it over, and we do have the same writing that we had on the home one. Um, I'm not overly sure what that says, but that's been heat pressed on. So we've got her name, Lara. It's been heat pressed on. That feels really really nice, really clean. There is a crease there for where the shirt's been in the bag, but once she's worn it or it's been washed, then it'll be absolutely fine. We've got number eight, again, heat pressed on. We've got the MLS emblem there in the number eight. And likewise, like the name, that feels absolutely lovely. Moving down to the hemline on the back. Looks really tidy. Stitching's a little bit off there, a little bit wobbly at the end there, but I'm not bothered by that in the slightest. Collar, it does look big still. Just can't wait to see her in it. You can see the tag for it, so that shows you how lightweight the material is. But there we have the shirt. We'll flip it inside out and we'll see what that's like. Okay, we're now on the inside of the shirt and the Adidas stripes have been embroidered in. And I think like the other Adidas shirts, actually, it's a separate bit of material, I think. No, actually, I think it's actually all in one. So the stripes have just been embroidered on separately. Collar line though, looks okay, apart from it being rather long. Inter Miami badge, embroidered on. 
stitching is not too bad there is the, the join there which we always expect to see and the adidas i've seen worse there's a fair bit of card there i think that'll all pull off though so yeah happy with that where the sponsor is that feels really smooth yeah that feels really nice and we have our washing instructions down there hand wash only and flip it inside out to dry that preserve the life of your shirts but all in all stitching line looks really good on the inside so far really happy with this one i think she'll love it we're on the final part of the inside of the shirt we have our size 16 up there and that's embroidered heat pressed on all the information we have our Adidas performance tag, size 16. Very limited with what's on the tag. We can see where her name's been pressed on, with the crease there. But like I said, once she's worn that, that will soon disappear. Number eight, pressed on, smooth as can be. Stitching out looks tidy. Just gonna see if I can push in and you can just make through how lightweight the material is. There you go, you can see it best with the Adidas. So you can see it relatively clearly, but it is dark and it's pink. So it's always gonna be expected to be lighter. But all in all, I'm really happy with this one. I think she'll like it. There is an additional item that comes with these shirts. And that's a pair of shorts, I'll show you them now. So here's the shorts that come with the shirt. That's got the number eight heat pressed on and the Adidas, although, well, no. Yeah, that's, there's not much of a gap between the D and the I and the D. To be fair, there's not much gap between any of them. But I guess probably because they're so small that they'll have to kind of squeeze it on a little bit. If we flip them over, we do have the Inter Miami badge. Do you know what? That looks much better than the actual shirt one. The shirt one looked pretty good. But to be fair, that looks really smart. Stripes, a bit embroidered into the material, as you can see just there. And I've got to say, the shorts actually look a probably the correct length when i've had the other shorts for the other ones they've always looked slightly longer but these look pretty much spot on right so there we have our into miami shirt for the 23 24 home season and yeah really happy with this one she's absolutely loves it um she has tried it on and it fits absolutely perfectly so if you've got a coming up to two yards so two in the next say month or so size 16 is perfect for them it is slightly longer but yeah, it's spot on really. Seller, photoshop3.com. All their details will be in the description of this video. If you've got any questions or comments, by all means, leave them below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. If you have enjoyed the video, hit the like button and consider subscribing because I do these reviews on a weekly basis. Um, if you have used Photoshop 3, again, let me know. Let me know what items you've ordered. I do like to communicate as much as I can with you and it's interesting to see what you people buy. So yeah, please do let me know. I said, thank you very much for watching. Hope you've enjoyed this one. I said, I've had a few people asking for kids' ones, so that's why I've done it. Smallest one available. Here it is. Thank you very much for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.